Happy holidays, everyone. It is the Scuff Gaming Showdown. And in Scuff's honor... Somebody tonight is walking away with a controller. Absolutely. The MVP of the series will get a Scuff Gaming Custom MVP Who's your controller. MVP so far tonight? Uh, Both I, teams. Pick I, one for either of the teams. Okay, I don't, on who wins. I don't think we can discount what Crim6 did in those first two games. I think he was a really strong start here for Complexity. Okay. Proofy is coming alive, though, for Envy. I think... Yeah. You know, Gunjar outscored him by just one kill in that last game. Had a huge round. But I think overall, on the domination, domination and big. then that last game of Search and Destroy, I think Proofy is the player who's shining for Envy. Oh, absolutely. I think Proofy is definitely the player that you're seeing shine for Envy. Like I said, I think he's going to take that just kind of main Slayer role, just killing everything. Slay. And yeah, yeah, a little bit of Slay. No, and Gunjar, I think, is kind of... Gunjar and Ray are going to kind of bounce ideas off of each other and just communicate well and just kind of do more strategy coordination type stuff. And then on the complexity side, I definitely agree. I think it's either Krim or Karma. And Karma had that monster game on monster Blitz. Monster game of Blitz. And, I mean, Krim has just been consistent the whole night. So Right. You know, you haven't seen a terrible game out of Krim. Had some great games. We'll see what he can do as our next one is going to be some Blitz once again. The map is Freight. Let's start with your screen as we got Proofy on yours. I'll be watching the complexity boys and... Let's keep an eye on uh, my MVP so far from this Envy squad. Yeah, and I mean, who, who yeah, Proofy, we're going to stay on board with. I know a lot of teams on this map, Pucket, they'll run four subs. I, you know, for Envy's playstyle, I don't know how much I like that. You know, Proofy's such a dominant AR. I'd like to see him actually use that AR. And you see all four members go down for Envy off the start. So Whoops. it looks like that should be a cap for complexity. But we don't have anybody actually getting a cap. They're going to set up and try and get a little bit of a spawn trap going. And, you know, there's actually the cap. But, you know, t actually they're going to trade kills. So it's going to be Proofy alive and then right up inside the base. You know, Envy needs to keep putting this strong pressure on Complexity. Yeah, that was TP who went through. But now everyone on Complexity is playing base D. Rambo has a good opportunity here. Switching over to the Bison. Won't be able to pick up the kills. Meanwhile, Merc inches away from the cap will get cut down. So... Going to be 1-0, complexity in favor, but Karma is the player to look out for. Let's switch over to this complexity side as Proofy watches one go through. Karma inside their base doing all oh, kinds man. of damage. Yeah, I mean, Karma is just going nuts right now. I mean, you can't see on the screen, he's still on board with Envy, but they are just getting spawn trapped by Karma and Aix right now. And this is definitely not the situation you would want if you were the Envy squad. I mean, look at Aix picking up these kills. Karma is just still going in pocket. Finally. Goon is able to take him out, but it's 4-0 to zero in favor of Complexity. Yeah, let me give you a score check real quick. Krim, 5-1. and one. Aix, 7-2. and two. Currently, 8-2 and two after that kill. Just waiting for the cap. There he goes. And Karma was 5-4, and four, picking up four straight kills at the base. Everyone coming alive for the co Complexity squad. And Aix doubling back to play some defense real quick. Is going to keep the score 5-0. What a phenomenal performance we're seeing from everyone. And Aix has now got the hot hand. Yeah, I mean, you know, Aix is such a, he plays off of such emotion. You know, when you see him at events, he is just going crazy. He is getting so hyped. And he's just making big plays. He makes tons of plays on the objective. And I think that's a lot of just underratedness in his game. He's such a strong, objective-minded player. But he also puts up huge numbers in the slaying department. Karma grabbing the sixth capture as we've seen them absolutely blow out opponents on this map. You saw it at Columbus when they dropped over 35 caps. What was the total I think in that was, game? It was 35 to 5 or 35 to 7. It was not it was not pretty for uh, it wasn't I believe it was fair. Skyline. Yeah, it just was not fair. And you know, I think t since we've uh, added Karma, we've only gotten stronger on this map because he's such an aggressive sub. Yeah. And on this map. If you can have four aggressive subs and just spawn kill, I mean, you can just put up ridiculous numbers. We're just going to stay on board with Karma. This is the Karma show right now. Let's take a look at his stats. He was 5-4 and four last time we checked. Currently, 7-4, and four, so just two more kills, but two more caps as well. You're going to see Aix, though, the player to watch. 15-6 and six at the moment with two captures as well. To put that in perspective, he basically has... Same amount of kills as Rambo and Proofy on the other side. Yeah, I mean, that's not good if you're Envy. You know, if you're Envy, you need a little bit more out of the slang department from your players. But it looks like Rambo is going to be able to get a cap. That's actually three guys down for complexity. So 
I mean, right now, Envy needs to keep on the aggressive play. I mean, you have Merc up top in their base, and it looks like one of the players is going all the way over to red. They need to keep up the pressure. And, you know, it's on Blitz, Pucket. A lot of the teams that win, it's just constant, constant pressure. Constant pressure. You got to smother your opponent. Down goes Karma, though. Aix was cleaned up. Now it's TP and Krim Six's turn. Can Teep win this battle? Big kill there. Gonna have three more players up though from Envy. His teammates trying to help from the side. He goes down. Now we switch back over to Aix. His Aix is gonna be the player pushing up most forward. I think this is a good opportunity for Envy to make their move as we're gonna see Proofy playing defense against Karma. Yeah, and I mean, I think you had Merc actually got caught going on the sneak right there. Oh, But it looks like Complexity is going to be able to get another cap. I believe that was Aix. That was Karma. Oh, uh, it was Karma. But, I mean, you still have Aix. I mean, he's 21 and 10 right now. I mean, Jeez. just dominating the kill feed. And I, this is just a dominating Blitz performance in this first half. Puck. Goonchar is held to 5 and 4 right now. Not yeah. 15. 5 and 4. 9 and 13 for Merc as well, despite a triple kill we saw from him earlier on. And now TP sneaks in for number oh, 9. Oh, man. And... Yeah, I mean, Aix just did something really dirty to Rambo. I just threw Rambo. up in my mouth a little bit. Yeah, I mean, I'm throwing up all over the place. That was pretty <laughs> nasty. Here comes number 10. <laughs> Why not put up double digits when you have 10 seconds left on the clock, says TP. We're going into this one with a huge puck lead it, at the puck half. It. Check 27 kills on the first half. That's not real, Aix. That's not, that's that, not right. I'm puck screenshotting it. this for the internet. Right, because, I mean, once it goes on the internet, then it's officially happened. So you have to put it on the internet. There you Boom. go. iPhone, beautiful invention. You can take pictures and put it right on the internet from one device. The interweb. We'll the enjoy interweb. this one. Yeah, I mean, if you... I mean, if you're living under a rock, I mean, that's a pretty ridiculous performance for the first half of a Blitz. I think that's the highest kills I've seen in the first half of a Blitz pocket. I don't know about you. Oh, yeah? I'm going to spawn in. What do you think about that? Well, I think you should probably spawn out all and right, try and spawn all right, back in. All there right, you go. Deal. That's probably the better deal. option. Back on do. board with the man who dropped 27. Yeah, I think it's only fair to watch him. You see, he is rocking that vector with that red dot sight, and that's all four down for Envy off the start again, and they're going to spawn in that back cargo area and you are going to see Aix push up into that top beer room. And, you know, Envy's going, I mean, Complexity's going to get another cap. And, I mean, right now, I think, you know, oh, my God. Aix just turned on Proofy pretty bad. And, you know, I think that body shooting out of that last game probably provoked Aix to go a little harder than he was going in that search and destroy. And, I mean, right now, sitting at 30 and 12 with a sub pocket. He's pretty angry. Yeah, I mean, are we about to see? I have not seen a 50 bomb in Call of Duty Ghost yet. Have you? Uh, honestly, I, I haven't. So I haven't. Have you seen? I've seen a I've 40. I've wanted one. I saw 40 the other night on Pro Scrims from Dito. I mean, we we are about. To, uh, we could definitely see close to a 50. How, I mean, how he's about at a 33, 33, 12, and three? That's. I mean, that's pretty good. I mean, if he pretty good. if he wasn't in our scuff MVP voting. Already, he is definitely putting his name in that ring right now. His ballot, <laughs> his ballot is is being submitted at this point. And guys, it's getting so close. I mean, we had Krim Six with a huge game, a uh, consistent play all the way through. Karma with the enormous blitz game. Now Aix throwing his hat in the ring here for this complexity squad. Who do you think is their MVP so far? I want you to tweet us. I'm at MLG Pucket. He is at Cole Mr. Underscore X. Yeah. Did I get that got right? Got it right. Whoa. Impressive stuff. Smart man you are, Christopher. Send us your thoughts right now. Complexity rolling over Envy in our game number seven. Six, something like that. Yeah, something along those three, lines. You three, know, one two. of those this numbers. Game six. Three, there two. We go. There you go. I can do math. Three and two is five. Next game after five would be six, Pucket. Cor so you correct. are correct. That is that is totally a fact. And I think we should just stay on with, I mean, it's Patty 16 Aches. to four. I think we should stay on with Patty Aches. And Let's see if he gets 45. I think, it, I think it's pretty challenge. safe to get 45. Two minutes, I mean, 42 seconds left to get 45. Uh, actually, I don't know. I think, I think there's a, I mean, there's definitely a very, I mean, he's going to get He's 40. not going he to cap. He's going you nowhere near the goal. There angry. is. There is no reason to do anything but kill if you are on this type of role. If I am, if you are Patrick Price right now, you are screaming at the rest of your team. You guys cap the goal. I am going to kill everything currently moving on the map. 
and that is definitely what you're seeing. I mean, this is some of the best He's Call of like Duty it's Ghost. Champs right this here. is some of the best Call of Duty Ghost gameplay you will ever see. And uh, I, Puckett, I think we are going to have our first 50 bomb right here. He's eight kills away with two minutes to go, Puckett. I. I don't know what he's doing, but I like it. I'll just yeah, say that. I, I, you know what? Like 40, you've seen, 45 was the goal. About I, I think he's going to hit ago. that goal, and I, I think, I think we're going to see 50. Well, here he is. He's dancing around. Gets I mean, one. If you're going to drop 50 kills on a blitz, I definitely think you have to probably push yourself into the top two of the MVP. I mean, especially if you're going to go something like 50 and 19 or something along those lines, I think that would definitely uh, put your name in the hat. Going big, my friend. Teep, on your screen for the moment, but Teepy, we love you, but really, there's one guy we yeah, want to watch. Yeah, there's one guy right now. I mean, this is this is a one-man army wrecking crew right now. I mean, you saw Karma. He busted out a sniper rifle. He's like, you know what? This is over. I, I don't know what I'm going to do, but I'm just going to let aches just slay and I mean this is like what I said before I mean you know he's a player who can do everything I mean some games you see him going big on the objective work some bigs you see him going big in the slang department and I would say this is what the? Uh, this is big in the slang department All right, 45 area. seconds left on the clock he, he needs, needs four, four more kills, kills for I, the 50 I, bomb what do you think he's gonna finish I think he's gonna go I think he's gonna go 48 and 20 48 and 20 yeah, and I think even that is probably just absolutely mental. I mean, at this point. You I, said you've never seen more than 45 before, correct? I I haven't seen more than 40. More than 40. 40. We had He's Dito. Got, we had Dito drop 40 the other night against Curse Las Vegas, Puckett. And that's I mean, impressive. Dito, I mean, that was insane. And I think that this is this is just as mental, if not even more insane. Oh my, Patrick Price, you called 48 and 20. He's looking for it. There's one number more. 48. Can, Can he get, get 49? 49? No, shots going down. Can't get the kill. It's stolen. Uh, he wanted that 50, but and 48 and 20, Pucky. I mean, Jesus, 22 to 6. We didn't even bring up the total caps because, I mean, going into that second half, it didn't even matter. It was so absurd. No need. Uh, yeah, you know, when somebody, I mean, when you're doing something like that in the kill feed and putting up almost a 50 bomb on Blitz, Puckett. I'm relaxing. I got my You my have your phone up. out. I'm That's... just tweeting. I'm like, Internet, you need to appreciate what just happened. Yeah. I mean, he choked the 50. I mean, that's uh, that's unfortunate. But you see TP is going 21 and 17 with 11 caps, putting up a triple-double in our Blitz game right here. And, you know, uh, for Envy, I mean, you see Merc going 17 and 30 and Goon going 18 and 30. And, I'm, I mean, you just can't say enough. I mean, Aix just dominated the kill feed right there. I mean, if you combine Envy's two top slayers right there with Proofy and Ray, I mean, he outkills them by four, Puckett. Yeah, I think the director was waiting for me to get off my phone. I'm not going to. But you're not. You're going to stay on your going phone. going on the Internet right yeah. now. This is what the internet was created for. The world for. should see this. Yeah. Patrick Price, I hope your parents are proud of you right now because I am, and I'm yeah. not even related. All right, guys, we're going to a quick commercial break. <laughs> Pat just put it within yeah, one I don't game. Yeah, I don't know what you say after that. I mean, there's really no, it out. Yeah, there's no, no really gameplay analysis to break down right there. So I mean, one the guy next highest on his team was 25. I yeah. just want to put that there. In perspective. And let you guys think about that. He had a 23-kill <laughs> difference. Between yeah. him and the next highest kills with the same amount of caps. He just went nuts. We're done. <laughs> Another one in the books. Complexity one game away from eliminating their opponent's envy here in the Scuff Gaming Showdown. What a performance. Patrick Price now at the top of the MVP you list. Guys, so? we're He's going to commercial break. When we come back, we'll see. Is it Krim? Is it Karma? Or is it Big Pat at the number one spot? Be right back. 